Hi guys, Justin here. It's another beautiful day here at Johnson RV in Fife, Washington. We are the Northwest's largest premium pre-owned RV superstore. What we do is we have a team of buyers that searches the nation for gently used units with super low miles. Then we put them through a reconditioning process to get them to as close to new as physically possible. Next to me here is a perfect example of that. This is a gorgeous 2006 Pleasureway XL TS model. Um, we'll go around the outside and then the inside. I'll point out a couple things, and if you have questions, you can call me, Justin, here at Johnson um, after the video. So starting off, like I mentioned, this is a Pleasureway. So this is one of those Class B uh, manufacturers that really is pa uh, paving the way. Everything is super nice, super elegant. Um, this does sit on the Ford chassis, big, nice big uh, V10 here. Uh, we'll swing around this way. Notice that you got your basic standard, um, you know, able to get in the passenger door, uh, driver door. You do have your entry, entry door here. You'll notice a couple non-skid steps uh, to make it easy, you know, making sure you're not, you don't slip getting in and out of the unit. Up above here, you'll notice you have a full-length awning. Um, it is manual. Moving back this way, you notice you do have your frameless windows here. You have access to the back of your refrigerator and freezer should you need that. And then this compartment down here is actually your battery compartment that actually slides out. Um, you're able to access those um, if need be. Swing back this way. We do have a 110 duplex here for plugging in your stereo or whatnot while you're hanging out, um, out under the awning. Do have a bit of storage here. Swing around to the back though. Notice we have these nice double doors here, access to the back area. Um, in the back is actually where you're gonna have access to your awning, um, your manual awning hook here, as well as when the awning comes out, there is this bracket that goes uh, down the middle to basically be able to better keep your awning up. You will notice a little bit of storage back here, which is nice, but just having this access is really what it's all about. Um, you'll notice down here we are equipped with our um, hitch already. It does have the seven pin connection. Um, this is a 5,000 pound hitch. Swing on this way. You'll have storage uh, underneath here as well as all of your hookups. So you've got your sewer hose, hose storage here. Um, this is actually where you're going to um, fill up your potable water. We do have an outdoor utility shower, be able to spray off those pets' paws or, or the feet after a sandy day on the beach. Um, underneath here, show you this here. We do have another uh, 110 access here as well as cable um, inlet, city water hookup if you're gonna be plugged in at your campsite. You do have your propane fill as well as your shore power hookup here. Um, I should mention this is a 30 amp service unit. Um, below you'll notice that you have an all-in-one hookup for your black and gray tank. So very easy, everything's super accessible. Um, right here, so makes it really nice. This is going to be where you fill up your gas tank, and then again, we're back to the front, and this is uh, basically how you get in and drive this thing off to your next favorite camp spot. But join me on the inside, I'll show you a few cool things. Thank you for joining me on the inside of this 2006 Pleasure Way Excel. Um, this is the TS model, but we're going to go over a few things in here. I'm sitting up in the um, cab area in the driver's seat. Notice that we have some nice leather seats here. Um, as I mentioned, we are sitting on the Ford chassis here. This is the V10. So a couple uh, different things up here you'll notice. Um, you have all your standards, such as your AC, your heat, that kind of thing. You do have a CD player here um, with all your basic you know, tuning channels, um, CD options, that sort of thing. Um, you do have numerous cup holders up here as well. And um, yeah, basically everything powered, powered mirrors, power uh, windows, so you're good to go in that regard. So starting up above here in the front, you'll notice that we do have lots of storage in this guy. Now this has flares on either side that make it feel quite a bit wider than your typical Class B, yet it still drives the same as a typical Class B. So all the comforts of being able to take it into your favorite parking spots or even to the drive through for that matter. Um, I should mention though too, this is uh, 20 foot in length total. Right behind the storage area, you'll notice our uh, microwave here. Um, this is convection. Beneath, you got a nice big storage. Now, when I said earlier that we look for gently used uh, units, uh, you'll notice this bag here. What this is, is a cover. This covers the entire unit. So the owner prior to us um, purchasing this definitely kept this thing in excellent condition. You do have a couple little tables in here that are able to be set up either here, a little uh, thing goes there, or in the back so you can dine either place. Um, when the, when the um, cover's out too, you have a really large storage area. 
Looking over here, we have our control center. So you are able to check all of your tank levels right here, as well as flip on that water pump. Um, you do have a uh, gen set inside, so you are able to uh, get this generator started um, from in, in the coach instead of having to go outside. Have your water heater here as well, and then just your typical uh, uh, smoke detector here as well. So moving back, we have our nice flush mount sink here, uh, sink cover, nice hard surface uh, countertops. This comes up into a stainless steel sink area. Underneath we do have our refrigerator that is a three-way, so uh, AC, DC, as well as propane. Something we like to uh, show off as far as Pleasureway's quality. Um, they are using real wood on these and it's super durable. Uh, something that I like to do just to show people. You see this little guy down here? I can jump on that and that's not going anywhere. Super durable. Very nice. This thing is going to last a long time. But check it out. Lots more storage all the way across the kitchen area. You do have a two burner stove top. Uh, that's going to run on propane there as well as some drawers underneath. You know, open and close those. Store your, store your stuff there. Before we get to the back, uh, let me just show you our bathroom area. You notice here we have our sink and vanity there, um, matching countertops here, as well as your north-south facing toilet. So, and it all is enclosed in one. Up above, we do have our fantastic fan, and then let's make our way to the back here. So, up above me, you notice we have our air conditioning here. Um, this is basically where you're going to be hanging out. You have a little TV here. Um, this whole area actually converts into one big sleeping area. Uh, something very nice about the Excel is that it's flared out. I'm six feet tall, and I can stretch out all the way across this back bench um, and have plenty of room. Um, then I'll no show you this too. You have a little bit of storage on either side. Again, I'll mention this is where you can set up another table right here. Basically, your leg goes in. You got a table here, eating for four or five people comfortably. But anyway, I'm sure you're going to have a lot more questions about this unit. It is in absolutely fantastic condition. Call me, Justin, here at Johnson RV. Our number is 888-833-9766. We'll talk to you soon.